What's up guys? Today we're out here rabbit hunting. Um um got Ann. She's a year old uh, beagle and she is fifty yards from me up here in this brush. Um actually she's right up there. But um she struck on she struck on one just a second ago. And she ain't been able to run it yet, but maybe she'll end up dropping it in a minute. I bet it's in all this brush, big old brush paw. But I gotta adjust, hang on a second. Trying to wipe off my screen. It's hard to do that. Alright, um, she's 45 yards straight that way. So let's go around there and see if we can see her and see if we can jump the rabbit. I've been just driving around and letting her run loose until she barks. And when she does, I just turn off the um, Jeep and go walk and try to find it. But we're gonna walk up in here and see if we can jump this rabbit up out of this brush. Right here, every time we come, now she's 35 yards down there. Keep walking around, just pretty much gotta wait for her to bark on it so we can figure out kind of where it's at. Right there she is. She's right up there working it hard, but she ain't barking. Um, We got some snow coming in, so I'm just gonna hunt for a little while and then, you know, take her back and we'll rest for the rest of the day. It's snowing just a little ways south of us right now. Not very far at all. Um, I don't know where she in, she went. Here we find. But um, yeah, it's snowing not far from us right now. So it'll be here in the next 20, 30 minutes, maybe. It's been snowing a little bit. It looks like it's starting to snow a little bit right now, but maybe we can jump a rabbit and kill one before it gets too bad. I've got some pups I gotta train. We got some good rabbit hunt laying back up in here. It's all of these cedars this way. And some cedars on this side with a bunch of thick grass and everything up in there. And then the thorn trees and stuff. And the that goes all the way down the hill down there. And everything. I've got four beagles right now. I've got two pups and two big dogs. One of the big dogs could be pregnant, so I ain't hunting her anytime soon. I don't know. Sorry, you guys are trying to look at my feet for a minute. I can't concentrate. And, yeah. And right up here. Yeah, there she is. She's got to come out up there. My hands are cold. It's like 30 degrees and... Whew, don't got gloves.
I was gonna wrap it last night up the driveway. That it was pouring down rain. It was storming last night. That's why everything's so wet this morning. But there was a rabbit and it was pouring down rain like so hard we couldn't see very far and it was a bad deal. But it it was just out and about. We seen it on the driveway. I'm kicking all these brush, pieces of brush like this because sometimes rabbits will get up underneath it. But this will be my first season having rabbit dogs. Um, I've had Ann for since last February, so I've almost had her for a year. Um, and I've had Queen for two weeks, and the puppies that I've got for a week. The puppies, I'd be hunting them with Ann right now, but they're um, a little new to me still, and they're a little shy. It's, their names are Salt and Pepper, and then I've got Queen, which is my other big dog. Then i got Ann. Queen is Ann's mom. And I'll probably end up selling her, but I want to get a pup out of her first. So I'm pretty, they, say, they think they're bred, that she's bred. But they don't know for sure, so hopefully she is. They don't want another one that's as good as Ann. Because Ann's been a good dog. She's starting to run hardcore at um, three months. Well, no, not three months. Four months, probably. And I ran her all through the summer. And we hunted and hunted and hunted. And it's just made her better, but she's not really got used to running with other dogs yet. I've got a guy that I go with that's got a bunch of dogs, and he ain't, she don't want to run with them. She gets, it's like she's intimidated. She won't even get, hardly get away from me whenever we're around them, but when we're by herself, I'm, I'm telling you, she goes crazy. I'll just run them. But she'll run with Queen, but... Queen's got a bad habit of running deer. And where I'm from, that's illegal in my in my county. So I've been break, trying to break her from that. She came from somebody that wanted her for deer hunting. But working on breaking her from that, and if I can, I'm just going to sell her. But... See this, that, there's a grown up field over there. There's like this oops, road right here that goes around. There's a grown up field. She should be able to jump one down here somewhere. She's a small dog right now. But I figure she'll get bigger. I'll kick this brush pole. Hopefully, there's a rabbit and get it. Nope. Looks like a good spot for one to stand though. Try to catch a rabbit in a trap to help train my puppies. Old tree stand that never got hung up the ladder in it. Well the yeah, I guess you call it a ladder. Got hung up. But we never did get the stand hung up there. I'm pretty sure the stand's laying down here on the ground. Here, there's the stand down there. But the deer come up out of the field. We normally plant some stuff in it, and they come up out of the field and walk along the edge of the stick stuff. And they come through this holler and everything else. I wish I could jump one so I could shoot it. I ain't shot a rabbit in two or three weeks. And it wasn't even in front of her. It was in front of the guy that I hunt with, dog. She was with us, but she didn't. She wasn't on during that race. Well, she wasn't running in that race.
seen that bird moving. I thought it was a squirrel. There's some birds. Bird's pretty close. But if you guys like these rabbit hunting videos, even though there ain't much going on in these hunting solos, but if you like these, give us a like and comment that you like them, and we'll keep doing them. And if you guys want to see some squirrel hunting videos, I'm about to get me a pup that I'm going to have to work on training, so you guys will see plenty of me shooting squirrels and playing with the puppy, trying to get them, get it going. Um, or if you want to see, um, me go out and try to shoot hogs or, um, try to shoot coyotes. We got a predator hunt coming up next week that I'm going to be in, uh, well, next weekend. And, um, it should be interesting. Max will be part of it, which is our other person and part of the YouTube channel. Um, uh, he's going to be part of it. And me and him will be a partner and come down here on our place and try to kill some stuff. But, um, and if you guys want to see deer hunting videos, say, um, leave a comment. And if you guys want to see it, I'll do it. I ain't been here in a couple of weeks. You can, I'm on a deer trip right here. But if you guys want to see me go, like, down here and just bring a climbing stand and set up in a random spot that I've never hunted before. I can do that, like on that tree right there. Climb up that tree or something. Um, I climb up. There are not many trees out there here to climb up. Um, you climb up. That's pretty much it, that tree right there. And it's not even a straight tree, so it's kind of sucked. And it'd be an easy shot, just cheap shot. Wouldn't have no cover, but oh well. Come on in. She's going to go across the other side of that grown up field. Come on. Come on in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. She's right down there. She smells something, but I figure it's a deer. She won't ever bark at it, though. She'll just smell it and keep on going. She now she's going up the hill. Come on in. Come on. Let's get her up in here. The squirrel dog I'm getting is probably going to be a cur dog. Uh, I've been wanting a squirrel dog for a little while now. Just hadn't had got one yet. Um, which I never really went squirrel hunting with the dog to the other day. And we killed seven. I, um, but yeah, if you guys want to see a deer hunting video, I can get, get bring a deer hunting video to you guys. We got plenty of does that need to be shot and stuff like that. Might even get a buck. And trapping videos, if you guys want to see me trapping, like I've got two sets I can show you. Um, that I've got set right now. I'm going to set two more next week. Um, it's kind of cold. My hands are getting pretty chilly. Um, and it's going to work at that spot right there and probably jump one. She's getting excited like she smells one. Oh, here we go.
If it comes through here, it's gonna be hard for me to shoot it, but I'll try it. I've got a little bit I can shoot through down there. I can shoot right down there. I can shoot with it running right there, but you know. I'm just hoping she'll jump it up. She ain't the loudest dog in the world. She's 70 yards, but it's also, she's in cedar trees. Jeez. Dang. System's going crazy. Shut up. She hasn't jumped it up yet, so I'm just gonna ease my way down through here after. Maybe she'll jump it up, or maybe I'll spook one up or something. You can see where she jumped it up. Well, started barking at it. She was right up in there. Woo! Slick one. It's really hard to walk with it being this slick. I have to be careful about how I step. But I'm wearing muck boots and they don't got very good traction no more. Seventy yards uh, that way. Gun ready. She jumped there, was it? Pretty sure. She lost it. I can see. I could see her for a second. She's trying. Well, crap! Every time I go show you guys, she moves again. She's making hard zigzags. I want to get inside of these cedar trees. Maybe I'll still be able to see. Coon crap. Or whatever crap kind of crap. Uh, we are in the jungle. See the rabbits get inside of here because it's good shelter. And they can run like no other in this stuff. We're in Arkansas. And <laughs> we got some wild rabbits. But then we also got some lazy rabbits around here too. I'm trying to sit right here. This might end up being a really good race. I need to find somewhere to sit. Like on something. So my butt don't get wet. My hands are freezing. I'm having to rotate them all. Oh, which one's holding the phone? I gotta get a head mount for my GoPro so I can video on that. Because I have to mount the GoPro to my gun right now. And whenever I shoot, it's pretty much a shot in the dark. I just shoot. Like I tried to make a crow hunting video earlier. And you guys can see where that went. It won't be coming out. That guy won't be posting it.
I don't really know how I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna switch you guys around like this. So I can have a rest while I got and shoot you. Well, there's a cow skull there. I didn't even see that. <laughs> My hand is freezing. I can a live stream, but apparently YouTube's created a new rule. You have to have a thousand subscribers to live stream. I was just gonna do that because it's easier. So if you guys don't care to help get us to a thousand subscribers, I'm gonna start streaming, and you guys can watch me live and see what I do on a daily basis. On well, on days that I stream, I have to stream probably a long time one during the day. On days that I could. There she is. I don't know if this is a cold track or if it's if she's jumped it. I ain't seen it yet, so I don't got a clue. But it's also kind of hard to see down in here. I feel like it's a cold track because she's running straight towards me. One thing I don't like about Anna is she's high strong. She always wants to play with the other dogs and we're hunting with other dogs and stuff. She'll calm down one of these days. I wish I wouldn't have forgot my gloves over at the Papa's. Because my hands are cold. I wish I'd have got my hand warmers out of my um, Garmin bag. Because the tracking system I've got is the Garmin Alpha 100 with, wait, I'm trying to get it out, with TT15 Minis, Garmin Alpha 100, if you guys haven't seen one, they've got a nice feature, that we got to figure out the button, that you can lock the screen, mine's locked right now, so, right now you can see, I'm zoomed in way, way, way. I mean, zoom, I'm zoomed way out. Now I can't find this. Oh, crap. But you can see where all I've been. This is a more on my grandparents' land. And it says right here next to me, but I don't see her. 85 foot up in there. Here, yeah, there she is. I kinda wish I would've brought the puppies now that she's actually barked on one. Got them puppies used to doing it. It'd've been a rodeo for me to catch them though. About to start snowing. Crap. I start to see some snow fall. 
I can't wait till next fall whenever the dove move in again. Go dove hunting. The only bird hunting I do is dove. I don't get to do any waterfowl hunting. Kind of sucks. I want to pretty bad, but don't nobody that really does it. I think it's dove season right now, but they ain't, I ain't been seeing none. I don't know that for sure that it's season though. I'm gonna turn off the phone for a minute and walk around and maybe go up to the Jeep again because I don't think she's ever gonna find this ride, but she's completely lost it. Buzzard. But I'll get back with you guys in a minute.